I tried to vlog facing the camera towards me, but you guys won't be able to see me after today, so I'm now walking in the morning. Finally today, I decided to get up and come walk. I've been feeling really tired, which is why I haven't got up in the mornings to do like my normal usual walk, but today I, I had a little bit of energy to get up, so we're gonna do our 40 minutes. My pelvic bone really hurts, so I'm kind of like wobbling a little and like walking like the penguins, but I'm still gonna do my walk. <laughs> I tried to record with the camera facing me, but you guys can't see me, so that's so why you have this view. Oh, my stomach is hurting. I hope she comes naturally. I don't want to be induced. I have some stretch marks. No, you guys won't be able to see me. It's pretty dark. But I have some stretch marks all around my belly button, and they hurt. They feel like like a sunburn. And I don't know if, like, I don't want to scratch, it just hurts. And I really thought that I wasn't going to get any, but I did. I'm not mad about it. I'm just, like, it's not, I'm not even bothered. It's just weird. I got them at the end of my pregnancy, and I thought they were going to be all over my stomach. But they're just around my belly button. And I think that's because that's where she's at. sugar right now. You don't think that if your radar goes off, it goes off when whoever has it too? We bought these single boxes because you get a free book, but I haven't even been able to redeem it. And we already have like three of these boxes, but I haven't been able to get it my free books and I need them because I'm making a little library for my baby she already has a lot but still and I'm eating cereal by the way I didn't leave my overnight oats the last night I forgot so gotta eat cereal I'm having pain like period cramp again now it's a little bit more intense but I don't know if it's like Braxton Hicks, contractions, or if it's just cramping. <sighs> Obviously, I don't know the difference between all three, so I'm just waiting to see what happens. If they get really intense, then it's probably contractions. I'll show you the better time. Just, yeah, just as a model, I'm stretching as much as you can. So, you know, los, los, los sacas, no, no, por aquí. Mm -hmm. Por aquí. Lo sacas. Uh -huh, to pull it. And then lo metes aquí. Lo sacas por aquí. Ah. Lo tienes, lo sacas. Yes. Y luego lo vuelves a meter tu dedo. Yes. one for your car seat you should be putting it already wait you just put it in oh it's easy look you just have it right here so we're gonna put it on first now only at the hospital because you're not gonna need any you need footage 
Let's see where this name is because they should talk to that. Yeah. Yeah, I know she would take this for the LA Dodgers. Can't can't really see it on camera, but okay, I'll leave that there. It looks really small. Ah. Because I even put a register. This is probably just gonna be for her little luggage. Yeah. Kitao Sakuske Sana in the Kosovo Luggage. If you want to take a bottle, you have to give her a little smaller one. It's because the other ones are like, they're fat. I know, but they're smaller. Okay. And she won't. I don't think they'll let me give her this bottle yet, but. The smaller one. Look at this bag with all the, the hygiene stuff. Okay. And then I think I should. Okay. Yeah, hold on. Because we're coming to go. Sometimes it lasts less. You like this type of like. I had to put it in here because I know I'm gonna yeah, chew. I wanna chew gum and I'm a leader. Okay? That's why it's there. Someone told me to take snacks, but no. maybe I will, maybe I will. I might buy I yeah, but I might take like the canola bars because that's what I like. Okay, so all of my hygiene stuff are here. What am I missing? Jesus. Let's see if I have my hair ties. What do I do? I'm going to put them in here as well so I don't get confused. And I won't miss them when I need them. Okay. It hurts a lot more when you're laying down. Yeah. Mm hmm <sighs> My stomach looks like I had surgery. to help you register.
Oh. Well, I'm gonna walk a little just to see if the pain goes away. I know it's not, but. Huh? I said I'm gonna walk a little just to see if the pain goes away, but I know it's not. Yeah, she is moving now, thank God. Just because she hasn't been moving a lot, and lately, like. I don't pay much attention to it, but like sometimes she moves, but I don't keep track of how many times she moves an hour, but I just wanted to feel her move to make sure that she's alive. And she moved, so she's moving. She's moving right now. Well, yeah, just go. I mean, I have to get on the anyway. Right now, if they pull you over, honestly, like, they won't even give you a ticket. They'll just guide you to the hospital. I kind of want them to pull us over. When I feel like I'm getting pain, it hurts a lot, and my stomach gets harder than it already is. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mom passed by, and it depends on your pain. Now we could pass to full on the rest. Okay. Why are you driving with your husband lights on? Because my... I'm in labor. You're in labor? Yeah. Oh, man. I, I thought maybe somebody got kidnapped. You're driving fast, you know? I'm like, what the hell's going on? Yeah, well, I think it was 85, 80? 80. 86, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you, you know, working your way through traffic. Yeah. You know? I'm thinking, like, somebody got kidnapped, and you're holding you at gunpoint, you know? Like, you're trying to let, let us know. I'm like, hey, you know, something weird's going on. But anyway, is your first baby? Yes. It's it was our first baby. So it'll probably take a little longer then. Your second or third for the delivery, that's good. You usually have longer labors, but man, yeah. How far are you? Um, 39 weeks, uh, in one day. You shouldn't be smoking or having weed around if you have the baby in there. I smell the weed. It's, it's like, it smells it, like it must be flower. somewhere around here. Yeah, is it really? It's coming from here? Maybe oh, yeah, somewhere, somewhere around here. here. I don't know. I, I apologize if it is. Nowadays, okay. you smell it everywhere. It, Somebody must be maybe smoking right here in this. Right maybe. Here. I didn't smell it when I walked up, honestly, until but I stuck my head in here. But now, they just smell yeah. you pretty much smell it everywhere. Yeah, dude, I mean, do you need an ambulance? No. You I think you're going to, are you going to Hanford? Yeah. All right, well, congratulations. I'm, it's it's got to suck. I'm sorry, it's got to hurt. It hurts. It Man, hurts. Yeah, <laughs> it's our I mean, first there, baby, right? so we're kind of like. Yeah. Did you bring your water break? No, not yet. Okay. I, it hasn't yet, but I'm sure it will eventually, or they're going to break it for me. Hey, you gotta yeah, just be careful, dude. Um, yeah, I mean, you, it's not gonna make no difference if you if you go the speed limit on the way there. Oh, okay. I mean, well, yeah. since ours is our first fare, we don't really, I don't, well, we don't really, really know, you know. Yeah, the, well, I mean, yeah. The so, timing. I, mean, I got well, you. I'll go ahead and. Like, but um, yeah, I can follow you there if you want. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, I um, But I mean, you still gotta don't don't go like fast. Oh, okay. You know, what I mean, I can't. We can't. I can't let you break the law. Yeah. But, like if something happens, I can. I'm a paramedic. Right? Like expire. I used to be a paramedic, but. Um, I know how to deliver babies if I have to, and, oh, but I'm going to write by the hospital. I call your name if we need to, but I'll make sure you guys get there safe and getting um, yes. yes, with the baby after me. All right. It's I'll, a girl. It's, oh, it's all right. 
Doesn't matter these days anymore, you know? Yeah. <laughs> Alright, um, I probably, the safest thing to do would just be to, to take the exit and then go across and get right back on. Okay, so uh, I just take the exit. Just go straight right. and then you come to the stop sign and then just keep going straight. Yeah, that's onto the on ramp. Then I'll follow you and then right. once you guys pull in the hospital, then good luck. Yeah. God bless. That's fine. It goes good for you. Okay, thank you. Alright, well. Is that a little much? Yeah. Is that it? It is. He's like literally right behind us. I think he has his, his emergency lights on. Yeah? That's why they're not passing oh, him. Oh, uh, the back ones. Huh? Yeah, the back ones. That's why they're not passing him, I think. Yeah, he does. Like, does he? Know about weeks and stuff, but you didn't even record or nothing. Like he yes, I did. Yeah. When he stopped you, yes, when he was talking to me, this thing was recording. Yeah, oh. you were recording him. No, the, the audio because I can't put it on his face. But were you trying to record him? No, technically, like, how am I gonna be like, um, yeah, but they cut, they, you cut the car. I, I guess I can, but I, I, I wasn't gonna do that. I just wanted him to pull it down. I'm gonna fucking pee myself right here, but yeah. We need to walk fast. Well, now let's wait and see what they're gonna tell, you, tell us. Because of this, some of that problem. If I'm, if I'm not dying here, if I'm not enabled, yes. I've uh, never seen someone somewhere. <laughs> this is the first time I've seen. No, he was, man. He, was so really he almost upset. crashed into my back bumper. He was really upset, yeah. It's because if him? you have your, your emergency lights and you're driving that fast, he said, so he thought someone was going to clean up or something was happening. That's why he pulled his over. And when he saw Kino Parastas immediately, that's why he turned on his emergency lights. I thought you were recording his face. No, not his face. I recorded the audio, but not his face. Uh, I was supposed to be seeing Dr. King. You have downtown Yes. I'm sorry? Um, well, yeah, I've been here before. Right? Like, with him? Yeah. I, I was. Yes, I was seeing Dr. Reeves, and then she switched me to oh. Dr. Royals, and then Dr. King. Whenever you said the first pregnancy? First. No other pregnancies? No. And when did you do it? August 22nd. Yes. Yeah. So they just checked me. And she said, I'm about three centimeters dilated and I am 70% effaced. And now we're connected to the monitors and we are monitoring baby. So if I'm admitted into the hospital, they will let my boyfriend in. And if not, then I guess I go home. But I'm just waiting to see if they're going to admit me today or not. No, it, it felt horrible. Oh yeah, it's, it's, it's a lot worse. Trying not to be such a no. You're doing good. Cindy, are you kidding me?
Should I um, test him? I think they told him he needs to be tested. Oh, yeah. She's been having uh, contractions since about 1400 today, and they're about every five minutes, six minutes, and then she's had some back to back, which you, you'll see on the, it's like coupling. She has some coupling, so two to seven. Okay. And she's been here. Um, she has allergies to penicillin. She's due 822, which makes her 39 and one. She's family health care network. She's going to do peak on call. She plans on breastfeeding. She has risk factors, GDM, specific diet control. Mm -hmm. Um, she's GBS negative, O pause, rubella immune, pet negative, or pure negative. It is definitely an emergency, but they're probably in there. Yeah. So she's yeah. having definitely having some bloody show. She's not leaking any fluid though. She's feeling baby moves. She takes prenatal vitamins and omega three. She was a good three for me, three seventy, and like mid position. Okay. Yeah, I was surprised. I was like, oh, baby's nice too. Okay. So good exam, and she's definitely having good breeze with this infection. So. Yep. So they finally brought me into my room. It's been about 30 minutes now, but they were, they were getting me connected to all these stuff. And um, right now I'm just standing up because the pain hurt. It's less. It hurts less when you're standing than when you're leaning down. But they went to go get my boyfriend right now. They left him in the waiting room and he has to be tested for COVID before he can come in. They also they also tested me and it wasn't it wasn't fun. But yeah, that's where we're at right now. And these are my contractions. So it's this right here. I'm not sure if you guys could see them but that's what it is. I hope this goes by fast. Oh, it hurts. It really hurts. And I'm also, I think I said this already, I was dilated three centimeters. And I was 70% effaced, so I think that's good. Oh, it's hurting. try to update you guys as I go but yeah I hope we're closer to four centimeters I don't know honestly this is my first time so it can go by really slow or we can be lucky and it'll go by kind of fast so we'll see what happens the nurse just came in and she said that I am contracting a lot see these are my contractions guys <sighs> and they hurt I'm still standing because it hurts to lay down. So I just wanted to see, show you guys the contraction a little closer. Oh. And there's my water. I might ask for ice and popsicles if they have them. And that's where baby will be. Hopefully in a few hours. That way you could show her whenever she's born. <laughs> They're gonna put her there first. And she's born and then in the little, I don't know what that's called, like a little crib. <sighs> but yeah, that's her heart rate. That's her normal heart rate. Oh. 
my goodness. Oh my goodness. Let me put all this crap on my hand. I'd rather be standing than sitting down on this yeah. like this toilet. Right? It hurts more, but sitting on the toilet, it really hurts. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I don't want to stretch. She showed him. I feel the contractions going I feel like it's going to be there. I don't know what I'm thinking. As long as I don't want to feel well, but I feel like I'm scared. I feel really hurt. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, I see if like, I open more. I hope it's just really, really fast. And I open enough so she can just like, like push her out right away. So my, my contractions 